Welcome back to Brampton Museum and Park. My name's Elise and I'm here in the wildlife garden next to the museum. And what a difference a year makes and a group of dedicated volunteers. The pond is looking absolutely gorgeous. It's been cleared of all the debris. We've had lots of new plants put in. Some of them have even been donated by local people. You might see there's a hedgehog hotel. There's a little uh, statue of a dragon. They've all been donated by local people and all the work has been done by our dedicated team of volunteers. Well, my name's Jeanette and this is Elaine and we both met each other through uh, the volunteer uh, gardening project. It was very nettly to yeah. say the least. I was in a bit of a sorry state. <laughs> yeah, didn't seem to have any structure or plan uh, for the planting so uh, we planted wildlife friendly plants uh, and they seem to have come up quite well. We had a grant from Newcastle Borough Council UK Shared Prosperity Fund, which has not only uh, transformed the wildlife area, but removed the inaccessible bridge and put in this new path. Um, well, it just looks rather more pleasant. I mean, it's got some flowering plants there that's obviously going to be attracting pollinators. And we put some plants actually in the um, pond for aeration purposes and more colour, more, more colour to it. Now. Yeah, and it could probably do with um, a few nettles pulling out. It's just a shame that the project came to an end. Really, would have liked to carry on. And I think by maintaining things with volunteers, mm. it, other people will be attracted mm. to it just because it looks visually much nicer. But you feel as though you're doing something worthwhile because it's a very well attended area and I've noticed especially during the nicer weather lots of people like to sit out here so it's just made it a little bit I mean it looks much nicer now than before we started so it just makes it so much nicer place to sit out. And I enjoyed the physical exercise that oh, we yes. got from it. Yeah. Um, as Jeanette says, we got plenty of fresh air in sun and torrential rain at times, but um, we were provided with waterproof, so we were fine. Yeah. Um, and it does look much better than when we started and it was, it was really enjoyable. The Wildlife Garden is a, a open to visitors. It's free to come in Tuesday to Saturday, 10 till 5 and Sunday afternoons. We're also using it for a whole load of nature therapy activities this summer. You can find out more about what's going on at newcastle-staffs.gov.uk forward slash wellbeing. I can also find out more by picking up one of our wild wellbeing trails. It's an ecotherapy trail, just 50p in the museum. We've got seasonal, one for spring, summer, autumn, winter that you can follow it round the wildlife and help boost your mood so we're really looking forward to seeing you over at the Brampton Park uh, Museum and Wildlife Garden really soon.